All right, welcome back to Mass Effect. In this video, we're going to look for the last remaining water valve on Fedos. Yeah, Fedos. And then kill the Geth. But we've got level points to give here, I didn't realise this. Ah, yes, Master Marksman. Nice. We're at 16 second duration, and that is just delightful. That is delightful. Now, t oh, you've got three points, Tally. Holy crap, her biotics are amazing. The biotics are actually amazing. So, do I want her to, to go into Overlord or First Aid? Because I'm... Tally's going into First Aid. Will it stack if they both go into it, though? That's what I want to know. I really don't know if they'll stack. Like, if Tally's 70 and Liara's... 70... Will stack... Or not. Or if it'll just be the highest of the two, or, or, or what? I don't know. Alright, but Tally... Hmm. The R can't get any kind of armor training. So I'm gonna put her into first aid. Yeah, I'm gonna put her into... She's gonna be our medic. Tally, you can get more armor, because you need to be a bit tougher. You'd, I know that sounds insulting, but you need to be a bit more hard-ass. Okay? Is that fair enough? Yeah, okay. Right, now, where are we going? Yes, we've got one more water valve to find. We've helped them with food and the power cells. So now we just need to find the Geth transmitter. I'm going to look in this direction first. Because we didn't go all the way. We went back after killing a certain amount of Geth here last time. So there might be something here. Hopefully. Oh! Oh, didn't see this. Oh, this will be the command center they had set up. Okay. Oh, excellent night. Better tungsten rounds. I believe that's the same as what I've got on mine. Yes, it is, but I know for a fact Tally has worse tungsten rounds on her shotgun. Yep, she's only got six. Let's give her seven. There we go. And let's decrypt this medical station. Because that's the only thing medical stations are good for. Decrypting. Uh, light human armor. I shall take a peek at that. It is rubbish. <laughs> Although it could be good for the armor because she wears human armor, doesn't she? Oh, that's actually exactly the same as what she's got. Oh, well, that's okay. That's okay. It's a shame she can only wear light armor, though. It's a real shame, because otherwise she could be rather tough if she, if she could wear heavy armor. I mean, why can't she wear heavy armor? What was that? Oh. Alright, so I guess we're going in the direction we were going in before. This way. And not to the sky way. I don't know why I would want to go there yet. I really don't know why, why I would want to go there. But anyway, let's get going. So, one more water valve and a geth transmitter to find. I want to have a good look for this water valve, because I've got a feeling it'll be in this first area here. I've just got a very sneaky feeling that it's not going to be far ahead. It's going to be right under our noses. Is it back here? No, it's not. Because some of those doors didn't look like they opened. And one of them had the power cells and the Varen objective in them. So I'm thinking the game isn't, isn't below, you know, the game is not averse to tricking you like that. Like, I had to check this door here, because that doesn't look like it opens. But the ones down here did, that looked exactly like that. So I don't know, it's very suspicious. Very. Alright, it doesn't look like there's a water valve here anywhere. And there certainly doesn't seem to be anywhere any. Anything we can do or anywhere else we can go. See, that doesn't look like it opens, does it? And yet it does, and the power cells in Varen were here. And there's definitely no way down here. Oh, oh, what's this? Have we been here? Oh, there it is! Nice! Holy crap. 
We are friggin' good! Wow, that is just insane. Now let's activate that water valve, so the water valve was here. I just wanted to shoot that away, sorry. If, only, if I'd only looked a little bit further along. Nice! Water restoration. Inform Maka Doyle so she can get to work. I should really go inform her about- That did it! The system is active! Yes, I realize that. Tally, the game told me. Now, I should really go and inform her of that now. Just so that, you know, just in case, like, if we finish the get thing and then we come back, we can't tell her and she doesn't realize the water's on or, or something. So I'm going to go back there right now. In fact, I'm going to plan to speed this up in post. I might forget. So just in case I do forget, I'm going to keep talking about potatoes and carrots and turnips. I've never had a Swede before. What's a, what are Swedes like? Do you know? Let me know. In fact, what are Swedes anyway? I know there's some kind of root vegetable, I think, but, like, I, I really don't know. In fact, the term root vegetable is very strange, isn't it? I think it refers to things like potatoes and carrots that grow in the ground, so, so as in, they are the root. A root vegetable. I think that's what it refers to anyway, I don't really know, but... I don't know, we'll see. So, if I did forget to speed this up in post, then you've been listening to me talk about vegetables for a little while now. I apologize. Oh no, we're not there yet. So let's keep talking about vegetables. Brussels sprouts. Never liked them. And we're back in Zoo's Hope. <laughs> Alright, Maca Doyle. Who is through here? She's at the pipe over yonder. This ground is very bumpy. I don't like the way the view changes when you sprint over an obstacle. It's, it's off-putting. The water started running not long ago. Thanks to you, I assume. Indeed. Now we just need to deal with the geth and we can get back to growing this colony. Here, a few credits for your trouble. Thank you again, Commander. You're very welcome. Oh, Maximum Paragon! I am the Paragon of Society! That's kind of what it means anyway, but still. <laughs> Alright, now we're gonna get back into the tunnels. And then finally start shooting some geth to bits. There's an objective. What's this thing here? Commander, what can I do for you? Uh, I'll talk to you when I learn more, luck, Commander. Is it her? What? I'm grateful for what you've done, but your heroics don't impress me, Commander. Oh, shut up, you bent. Commander, you're incredibly rude. She'll be the first one to die when I kill them all. <laughs> okay, now, no, no, no. Now it does specifically say the tunnels, and these are the tunnels. So therefore, we go back into the tunnels and look for some more Geth. Well, not some more Geth, the Geth to kill. And don't worry, I'm not going to be talking about vegetables this time because I'm not going to speed this bit up. I might even forget to speed the previous bit up. I really kind of suspect I will, because I'm being very forgetful with editing lately, and I've got such a such a huge backlog that, in fact, you know what I'm doing to get the videos up online these days, but since I've got so many to go through. I'm basically extracting the audio streams, working on the audio streams, and extracting and exporting the videos from Action to a H.264, an MP4 wrapper format, and then I'm just muxing the audio to the video. The completed audio, one single single audio stream to the video, and uploading that. I'm not technically doing <coughs> I'm not technically doing any video editing at all. I'm just sticking two video a video and an audio stream together. That's all I'm doing. But anyway, I'm gonna use my sniper rifle here. Because I want to. Oh yeah, oh, bombs, there's a shock trooper. Good thing is, they're about as accurate as a shock, it's a storm trooper. Oh, bombs. Bomb faces. Oh, well, well thanks, guys. <laughs> oh, there's a turret. A very weak turret, but a turret nonetheless. 
Alright, I think we're safe here now. Krogan! Krogans? Why are the Krogans here? Lomanak! Why are you shooting him? He's dead. Or maybe he wasn't dead, I don't know. I'm not a Krogan specialist. <laughs> Run away! Oh, then thank you, girls. <laughs> I run away screaming, they stand there shooting. Good on you. <laughs> okay, where are we? Where is the transmitter? Ah, oh, shred rounds, that'll be good. For in case we face more Krogan. Ah, I didn't even notice that area there. I thought it was a dead end. Technician kit in the transmitter tower. All right, let's open both of these things up. And boom! Oh, and another, another level up. Wow, level 41. Not bad. And I've got a little bit of renegade. No, I'm now a bad guy. Okay, anyway. Now, where can I put my points now? Because I can't get heavy armor. It would be nice, but I can't do it. Infiltrators just aren't strong enough to wear it, unfortunately. I think now I might start going into fitness, because both attack things full, decryption full, electronics at master, so I've got all my attacking things maxed out, apart from damping, which doesn't do damage anyway, and I don't use it all that much, I'm not going to go into damping. So I've got all my real attacking things done, just sorted and done and sorted. So therefore... Therefore, I think I might start going into fitness. Because extra health would be good. And that doesn't increase shields by any amount. Although electronics does. Hmm. Yeah, from like a 180 boost. To a 200. That's almost a 100 boost in shields right there. F practically free from skills. Uh, that's so tempting. But then extra health is also tempting. I think I'm going to max electronics out. That's what I'm going to do. I'll rate Tally. No, Larry, no, you're not Tally, you are. I'm sorry, Tally. Um, yeah, first aid. And Tally. Yes, Tally. Hello. Um, <laughs> you will go into... Uh, what was I sending you in? To... Oh, should maybe get AI hacking. I'm going to get AI hacking and have a specialize in that once I get to it. Get that maxed up. So what does that actually do? It drives all but the toughest robots. Robotic enemies berserk. Uh, lasts for 30 seconds. 40 second recharge time. That's not bad, that. Accuracy talk cost 80%. That's rather high, but it, it should be fine. All right, let's save the game. And then get back to the colony, I guess. Because we're kind of done. We've done all the things we need to do. Now, there's just that Prothean Skyway, but I really don't know where that sits in the mission or anything. Hmm. I suppose we will find out in the long, short term. In the long term, that doesn't even make any sense. Ah! Holy hell! <laughs> oh, that is ridiculous! That is ridiculous! Ridiculous in a very, very good way, mind! But ridiculous none the. There was a way to go further down there, wasn't there? Because in the very last tunnel bit is where we found the water valve and we didn't go any further, we just came back. And that was past the entrance to where we found the transmitter there. Yeah, that was down there. Like down there. And the transmitter's there. So what's past here? We should maybe have a look. 
Like, just in case there's something secret. Doesn't seem to be anything. There is a door. We can keep going on. What the hell? What? There's a guy here. Hello, N Ian Eustead. You don't want to go down there. Who are you? What are you doing down here? Nothing I should be, and anything I shouldn't. No! What the frick? Ah! That was a good one. Very intense. Did you just have an orgasm? What's the matter with you? Just invoking the master's whip. What? Helps remind me I'm still alive. You're here for the Geth, aren't you? You're not the only one interested in those things. What do you mean? Who else is looking for the Geth? Not looking for. Looking to get rid of. They're a thorn in the side of the- ah! I'm Trying to get to the- Dying! What the hell? <laughs> this one is no longer fit. We should leave him. No- Yeah, obviously. Is there anything I can do to help you? Do you even want help? Help me? No. No one can help me now. I'd rather die fighting! Fighting what? Fighting what? Not that kind of fight. It's like running through a thorn bush. The more you struggle... Time's up. Company's coming. What? Ask Fidan. Ask him about the- ah! What? Look out! What's coming? Ah, uh, Geth. What the hell is going on? Tell me! I won't. I won't do it. I won't. I can't. I can't. I won't do it. Okay, so we can't go any further down here. Can we go through here, whatever's there? Okay, so what the hell is going on here? Ask Fidan about the... The what? Maybe that's why the colonists were trying to tell me to ask Fidan about the colony, because only he could... Say it or so, Say something? I don't, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> There's something going on, though. At first I thought it was rather culty, but then he kind of had a bit of an orgasm in front of my eyes. So, I, I really don't know. I really don't know. There are no more Geth showing up. That is sort of a plus, because we kind of get money and experience for doing nothing, really. <laughs> I can't get over how powerful we are against the Geth right now, though. I really can't get over that. Why am I still poisoned anyway? Heal me up, girls. Do it. Do it now. So they don't have access to first aid, so I'm assuming it just stacks. Everyone's first aid skill stacks. That's what I've got to assume. It has to be like that, hasn't it? Otherwise, what's the point of having NPCs with first aid? Unless it only applies to them. So their first aid boost applies solely to them. That's why everyone can get it. And that's why the skill is for everyone. Like, everyone can has the access to the skill. Ah, uh, that could very well be it. Uh, that could be it, yeah. Okay. Fidan, what the hell is going on here? I'm helping you out, but level with me. Commander, what can I do for you? Strange behavior. Some of the colonists are acting strange. We've been over this, Commander. The colonists are my concern. The Geth are yours. Well, I've stopped them. Now the colonists are my concern. I destroyed a Geth transmitter in the tunnels. They won't be a problem any longer. Thank you, Commander. We're in your debt. You've taken a great weight off my shoulders. I just wish I had such good news for every problem. Another topic, please. Let's talk about Zeus, Hope, and Pharos in general. Of course, Commander. Man in tunnels. What was he doing there? Who is he? And what was he talking about? There's a guy living down in the tunnels. Is he one of yours? That would be Ian. He's very sick. No kidding. 
He seems to be more than just sick. He hasn't been the same since the attack. We tried to help him, but he wouldn't listen to us. I can't help my people if they won't listen, Commander. Then do something for him. Don't you have medical supplies? Something to help him? I wish it was that simple. Ian was a good man I'd like to have with us. Please, Commander. I'd prefer not to talk about it anymore. You're not telling me everything. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Alright, so we've done all the things they want us to do. What is there to do now? Pharos Geth attack. Get to the Exogeny headquarters, that's right. Ah, take the lift from Zeus Hope down to the Prothean Skyway. Right. Down to the Skyway? Surely we'll be up to the Skyway. Alright, we've got to head to the Exogeny headquarters. So, that seems like a good stopping off point. So I'm going to end the video here. And in the next one, we shall head to the Exogeny headquarters. Shall we, girls? Well, you're technically not a girl, Liara, I don't think, but... Still, I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.